on October 29th, uh, 2025. I got a text message the other day from someone who said that he is trading options on the volatility of the market with an expiration date of October 29th in order to make money. And I immediately thought that I don't know if there will be meaning to money if this object turns out to be technological <laughs> after October 29th. If you want to take a vacation, take it before that date, um, because who knows what will happen. Another faction, however, says now, wait a minute, perhaps this is a visitor an intelligent visitor from another solar system and perhaps this week we could have a test of it. That's right. This week it turns out that the asteroid or comet will be whizzing around our sun and if it picks up extra energy on its flyby that would clinch it. That means there's extraterrestrial intelligence involved. So watch for it. On October 30th, starting then we're going to track it to see whether it gets an extra boost of energy. If so, it means we are being visited. Oh, uh, That's right. And as it goes around the sun, there's something called the Oberth effect. The Oberth effect says that if you were to whip around the sun, you would pick up extra sun. So uh, it's Wednesday, right? October 29th, I think it goes the closest point to the sun. Is that right? That's right. That's the perihelion. Okay. And at that point, if it picks up extra energy, that's outside the ordinary bounds of the conservation of energy. So watch for it. As it whips around the sun, if it picks up extra energy, bingo. It means there's intelligent life uh, that is guiding the motion of this object.